down in Bloemfontein. And it's the Toyota Cheetahs up against Tafel Lager Griquet. Kimberley and Griquas got the second largest hole in the world. The largest hole is the one we're going to put in your defense. <laughs> <laughs> Check who's on top of the log. Remember, we beat you twice last year, and this year, today, is going to be the third time. Got his team on the front foot, and they've got enough power, surely. Uh, Joseph Webb Gerber has got it. Try number three for the Cheetahs. As you can see, it's half time, but uh, I don't know what is happening to the Hrikwas. I will not the end them for Hrikwas, but I will not the end them for Hrikwas. I will not the I mean, you're like a Mosi Jet Legacy. Isn't that 180 kilos? Kimberly, Bloom. Oh, my goodness. They're not coming out. We have Greek Cross missing. Can, can somebody call Tender Bowen? They've gone back home. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Yes. Woo! Woo! Played this by the pack. Very unified as they march towards the line. And can they get over? Yep, they've done just that. Oh, we've got some fans here, and uh, tell me, sir, who do you support? Actually, I'm a IFL Lions fan. It's funny, war felt off, but we don't really support. We just came to watch the rugby, but I um, look like Rikwaza catching hiding today. We are currently busy with an investigation, as you might have seen during halftime, what the score is standing on. I'm sitting here with Marshall. Marshall, good afternoon. The people of Kimberley would like to find out that what has happened to Bushi as there's allegations that the Cheetah fans have kidnapped Bushi. Is Bushi still alive? That is what we would like to know. What do you do the Cheetahs today with the Griekwas? And also there's other allegations that the Cheetah fan has actually put Vaseline on the one side where the Griekwas are playing. How do you respond to those allegations? Life is not easy, you know, one must adapt and that's what we teach our children. It looks like from now on at the Toyota Stadium, it will be sleepy and slidey for the Griquas. I know how to keep it real with the Millenniums, watch this. Yo, 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 what's up? Yo, oh, bro, I'm trying to watch the match. Oh. Ladies, say Griquas. Cheetahs! Near, near, near. Griquas. Cheetahs! Yeah. As you can all see, the level of education in this country, even kids are turning orange. Uh, Daddy, what happened to your daughter? I see she's turning orange. She's a pure cheetah, pure cheetah. Uh, at the moment, this child really looks sick. Do you maybe want to move to Kimberley so that she can at least get a bit bluish? No ways. And the scoreboard just keeps on ticking over for this cheetah's side. Exceptional play. Oh, there's somebody just going to put the ball into touch. So we've had enough. But everybody wants to play. Yes, for sure. Being a tall fella, he's managed to get above it. Here he comes. Louis for sure. And what a finishing touch. Try number 10 for the cheetahs. It's the Cheetahs that dominate in the City of Roses, winning 68 points to 14, 10 tries to 2. Uh, what a wonderful win for us, our Cheetahs. You know what? Well done, boys. When I woke up this morning, I thought maybe we can beat them by 10 points. And on my way here, I thought, you know what? Maybe we can win them by 20 points. But when I saw this Griquas team, I thought maybe we can beat them by 50 points. And you know what? We did. And what have you got for yourself to say? Because you you had a lot to talk this morning, you know? And uh, yeah, I don't, he's very quiet now. And I must say, what have you got to say for yourself? Uh, comrades, 
I just need to make this record clear and categorically state that this matter, we need to establish another commission of inquiry into this matter. What happened to the point? Hmm? What happened to the point to the Greek ones? I guess Mukhman. Let me tell you, go cheetah, cheetah. Ons sien jylle vrijdag aan. Lions, ons wacht vir jylle. Ek is Nicky Van, Team Commissioner van Toyota Freestyle Cheetahs. Thank you.